You're a pretty one. You're a pretty one. Yeah. That's a good cow. Okay. It was super cute, but it was just a little too dark to get good video. So I'll just have to reenact the chicken ramp school. We've kept these little chickens locked up in our mobile coop for more than a week so they'd know that this is their safe place and remember that this is where they're supposed to come back to at night. Even though we have an electric fence, I don't want to trust not shutting them back in at night. There are raccoons out here. Well, after the first day, of our little chickens having free access to the ground. All but three of them managed to figure out exactly how and when to get back into the mobile coop at night. Those three that were left were looking a little worried. They were hopping around the, the ramp and looking up and peeping at their little friends. They looked a little confused. First I shut the ramp so none of the other chickens could get back out. And then one by one, I caught each of the remaining chickens. This is how you show a chicken how to use the chicken ramp. The next night, all of the chickens managed to get back in. One of my picture framing customers brought over a nice big bag of snacks for our rabbits. Thanks, KB. More snacks over here.
are more interested in the camera than the snacks. Let's see if Indigo also likes these snacks. Here you go. Ooh, shocked me. <laughs> Gotta be careful. Does Indigo like snacks? Did I even have to ask? I'm sure the chickens up in our big coop would really like some of these snacks too. The cows don't come over here very often. But they made it back over today. I'm actually glad to see him eating back the weeds. Grazing is a perfectly good way to manage weeds. Just to give you a little perspective about where we are, this is our boy goat shelter right here. And the cow, one of the cows, is just coming right up to our property line. What do you think of the cow neighbors, Striker? You like cows? I don't think Stryker cares one way or the other. Clearly not interested in eating from my hand. That's okay, chickens. That's okay, chickens. It just means more for you.
chickens do like their snacks. One of my favorite snacks this time of year are blueberries fresh off our blueberry bush. We have been watering this throughout this dry spell we've been having. But as you can probably see, the really hot weather we had caused some wilting and dieback. Fortunately, there's still plenty of berries. We do have a lot of birds out here and they will eat some of these berries too. Fortunately, it's such a big bush, we've always had an abundance to work with. Wendy was just out here the other day and she picked a whole big bowl of them to freeze so we can have blueberry pancakes any time of year. I think maybe I'll pick some of the higher ones that she couldn't quite reach. If you like what we're doing out here, please click the thumbs up, or better yet, leave a comment. And if you want to subscribe, just click our picture. You're a pretty one. You're a pretty one. Yeah. That's a good cow. You're a good cow. Yes. You're a good cow, it's okay. What do you think, little baby goats? Do you like the cow neighbors? Are you big fans of the cows? You just wanna know what's going on.